Hey guys, it's Miss Densky here, and I'm back with another video on how to make a quarry system. It's really simple, and I'm already starting started lagging. This happens every video. A minute, how can I? Only I'm tiny. Anyway, we'll carry on with the video. Okay, so here we go. First of all, you want to set up your quarry, like so, and dig three spaces underneath it. Once you've done that, you want to do glass pipes like this, and you should have an engine, which is a electrical engine, or sometimes a combustion engine, and you're going to put them there like that. You also need, sorry, I'm missing something, a lever. Okay, so now that you've got, oh, now you've got the lever, it should so far look like that. It should have this yellow and black outline. Okay. So once you've done that, you want to bring out this glass pane. And you need something called an MFE, or a backed cave or something, I can't remember what the other one's called. And it needs to face, this brown bit needs to face towards the quarry like this. So once you've done that, you're going to want to just carry this on. minute like this I'm just going to bring mine out once you've done this you want to connect wind turbines normally go in the air so you can do it by solar panels oops sorry about that ok so like that and here we go and of course it's better if it's like if it's sunny outside for solar panels and the number in here should be increasing and I'm going to show you really quickly a technique how to use a really good way of the solar panels energy so if we can just increase this And it's called the flower. Mm. Okay, I think it's like this, if I can remember. Um, need one there, one there. So in other words, just keep covering it. Oh. In other words, just keep covering it until it's fully done up here. Yep, I think I've done it right. There we go, and there's your flower. So now that you've got the energy there, you've got the this increasing in power, you now have to place your levers down, if there's stuff like this. See, I'm being a bit dangerous here, and activating this before, but it's just because there's this mountain bit, and pipe will start going around cutting through the mountain. So now that you've done that, you want to place some chests can place some oh not on top of there but some here and you want a, I'm going to use cobblestone and you're going to place it at the top and just this way oh, and it should nearly be done So in other words, you just want to make a pipe leading on to, oh it's here, to the inventory. I can just carry this on, carry on going. So like that, it doesn't have to go in through the top. So yeah, now you've done that. Um, I'll be back when this has cleared out this rock. Guys, I'm back with uh, the second half, and here it is. 
this part here, nearly finished, better not stand aside. And that last bit of stone. There we go. Now once that's done, it will create this, I believe it's a diamond drill, and it will just go to the corner. Come on. It's best not to stand in the area just in case. More of these equals more power and also more solar panels and so far that's going up pretty fast. So then we'll start doing this and you can see of course it turns into cobblestone which then goes through here. So there we go, a bit of dirt and and then right from that it will just carry on going through the pipe and it will then end up in these inventories. So, okay. Sorry about the minigo, I was like not speaking, but speaking because um, I was kind of doing two things at once. <laughs> um, so, here we go. So, yeah, that's about it. Um, I'm just going to show you this really quick thing. Um, Okay, and say if I, that's the average size, that's the normal size for a quarry, and if I just place this here, no, oh, no, I did that wrong, if I just get some, the, I, my, me and my friend called him Mark, if I just get Mark, and I bring him all the way over here, hello Mark, they've got to be all the same level, so we can do it there. And then you right click on it and it will send a line of what sort and then you do one there and it will just create that once you've done that you place a quarry next to it and of course you do the same process as before um, except you just made your own customised size of a quarry and it's just exactly the same as before so yeah i hope you guys have enjoyed this tutorial on how to make your own custom quarry size and your own quarry and just to quickly prove to you there we go it's like every single one one goes that way one goes that way one goes that way one goes that way um then oh one hasn't even gone in there yet there we go i'll just go like that there we go. So yeah, it will just eventually go in. There's also another box where it will change it to whatever you place in there. So I can put a diamond in the top left and it will change all this rubbish into diamonds. And yeah, I will be uploading a video on this massive quarry process um, which I have made. And so yeah. I hope you enjoyed this video and you found it useful. Any faults or anything you need help with, uh, just ask in the comments. So, yeah, thanks for watching.